Hello YouTube, welcome back to my channel. This video is going to discuss the DIY paver foundation for shed. Here is a quick before and after. And before I get into the video, I just want to give a quick shout out to Evergreen Supply. If you're located in the San Jose location, I really recommend this business. No, they're not sponsoring the video, but I've bought a lot of base rock from there and they sell a bunch of other items pavers leveling sand anything you need when you're remodeling a home or landscaping this place has it so highly recommend them all right jumping right in as you can see i had a lot of trash to clean up a lot of stuff lying all around the ground after i tore down the previous shed my main goal at this point was just to clear everything out of the way try and level the the terrain as much as possible next section i broke out the heavy artillery i ended up renting an electric tiller from home depot to try and break up the dirt and i would use a shovel to get that extra dirt out of the way i was doing everything i can to get the ground as flat as possible i didn't know what i was doing i'm having fun this is my first time ever doing any type of work like this so I'm just taking everything I learned from YouTube. I'm almost ready to lay pavers. Um, I was able to get it a lot flatter than it was before. At this point, I'm almost finished. Very excited. Uh, like I said before, I've never done anything like this. Here is the finished product. I just needed to add my edging around the perimeter. But before I did that, I laid down the polymeric sand and I used a broom to sweep the polymeric sand in the cracks. I used a tamper and a cardboard underneath it to lightly tap the sand into the cracks. This part was more fun than I thought it would be taking my water hose and spraying the pavers. That way I can activate the polymeric sand and it will act as a glue and make the pavers stick together a lot easier. So I sprayed the entire surface and I was told to let it sit for about 24 hours to let it dry. So that's what I did. The next day I came back with my blower just to get extra dust and sand that dried up on the surface out of the way before I laid my edging. This is basically the finished product. I really like how it turned out. I have my edging on the sides and the back and the surface wasn't moving. The pavers were pretty strong. So overall, I like how it turned out. For this to be my first time doing something like this, it gave me a lot of confidence moving forward on my future projects. Like I said before, I am not a professional, but I feel like with all of the knowledge that I'm learning from watching other videos, it's giving me the inspiration that I need to tackle certain projects and make it look better than how it was before. This to me definitely looks better than how the previous foundation was and the previous shed. So I'm excited to start to build the shed that I purchased. As always, I will post the links in the description of the tools that I used in this video. I hope you guys enjoyed watching and following me on the journey to DIY build my paver foundation for my shed. I will post the shed build in the next video and hope you guys continue to watch and follow along. Thanks for watching.